Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those of y'all who don't know me, my name is Paloma and today I'm going to be doing a huge Shein haul. It's going to be a little bit of everything because I do a lot of stuff so I need like different styles of outfits if that makes sense. So some it's like I got like some business clothes, some clothes that I can wear to like Los Bailes and Honey Bales, some that are a bit more like modern like streetwear and then I also got some dresses as well. I think this haul was... I want to say close to $300. I think it actually was $300. You'll see it in the title. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and also leave like the screenshots of like the actual products. So if you guys want to order it, FYI, this video is not sponsored by Shein. So you'll get my full opinion. Um, one of the items unfortunately didn't fit, but it's fine. It's fine. I'm just going to return it and order a bigger size. If you guys want more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe, comment, and like. And let's get started. I'll just go ahead and start off with these because these are the ones that did not even fit. Um, um, which is so unfortunate because I really like these because they have like these little like detailing right here where, where it's like metal detailing here along the sides as well and it's like super cute and I feel like this style of jean can just pretty much like fit with um like go with anything and it doesn't stretch like at all and this is why it didn't fit and usually with Shein like I order a large and anything pants just because I have bigger thighs and I'm also um pretty tall well, I don't want to say pretty tall I'm 5'8 ish like five seven five eight um uh, but this one didn't even get past like my thighs which is again so unfortunate so this is a large i'm gonna return it and order an extra large and hopefully like it still fits like up here because you know how like it'll fit your thighs but it won't fit your waist so anyway this is like i just wanted to show you guys this one because again super cute but like unfortunately didn't fit so i'm gonna go with this next top here that i loved i feel like culture tops are really like in right now so i got a few actually um so it's this one it's like weird to like hold to show you guys but i'm gonna include a picture in here i ordered a medium just because like or if it's smaller up here so usually i would order a large but like if it's one of those shirts where you don't need a bra to wear it i will order a medium um and it has like this little belt thing right here focus please that it's like you tie at the top and i thought it was going to be uncomfortable but it was not whatsoever and it has like the zipper goes all the way down so you just put it on i actually paired this up with another uh, pair of pants that i got from shein which are these now like i said i do order these in a large because yeah a large because my thighs don't freaking fit in these otherwise these i have nothing bad to say about them they the length was like the length was perfect the pockets as well they're all real right let me not lie to you yeah they're all real the only thing it doesn't have pockets in the back which is kind of annoying because i have a habit of like putting my phone in my back pocket but it's okay um again super super comfortable these also don't stretch though like not that much and i feel like these also like can go with like black or like white and like I paired like you'll see in the picture. I paired them up with these and just like some basic Air Force Ones. And I'm usually like in between an eight and a nine in pants. So in Shein, that translates to like a large, except those freaking jeans. Um, so this I did get in a large. Next item that I got was this green corset here, that was like again like halter tops and corsets for me like are in. I have so many of these shirts now um that i just like i don't know i feel like they go with so much and they make you not they go with so much but they make you look like skinnier because like this cut like for some reason makes you look like like a tinier waist you know this one also has a zipper in the back it's not my favorite thing in the world for corsets to have zippers in the back because i feel like you can't adjust them as much but this one you can adjust it here which i liked as well and it's like a like a windbreaker material it's not really like cotton or anything it's actually pretty thin but like not see-through i feel like this color is also in um and you can style it with like jeans um I don't know if I would put it like with the camo pants that I just showed you guys, but I feel like you could still do a lot. Nothing bad to say about this one. I ended up getting a medium in this. Okay, so this next item I absolutely love because this is an actual like corset corset, you know what I mean? Because it has like the wiring here. It is a little bit of a shorter cut, but it like you can fit it like lower to where like your chest is like pushed up a little bit and it actually has like the adjustable strings in the back which like i said i love in a corset because it's actually like what a corset is to me and then in the front it actually has like this the little hooks kind of like how a bra does 
I ended up getting this one in a large just because I was afraid because it doesn't stretch and I saw that it was a corset corset. I was like, let me get it in a large because like with me, I'm also like, I'm pretty wide and I have a big back. So like sometimes a lot of the clothes that I get, they don't fit from like, or like the shirts, I, they don't fit from here because like my back is pretty wide. So because I didn't stretch, or because I didn't stretch, because this material doesn't stretch, I ended up getting it in a large. And I feel like you can dress this up like with jeans and heels and like kind of like in a going out outfit or you can make this Western um, as well. And because it's like pink and it's a solid color, I feel like it could go with like a lot more stuff as if like versus if it were pattern, you know what I mean? These are a pair of jeans that I got because I feel like I needed a new pair of jeans that were just kind of like basic. Um, for sh for With jeans for me, I'm one of those people that kind of prefer to buy like American Eagle or like Hollister jeans or like Levi's or Wrangler's just because like the quality is better. But for Shein, these aren't that bad. Like you can tell they are Shein jeans. But like they don't look terrible like because I've bought some Shein jeans where they just like make your butt completely look flat And this one doesn't like doesn't do that. It doesn't like shape it, but like it doesn't make it look completely flat You know what I mean? These I got in a large and they're just like I said simple jeans like I feel like these are they go with everything um, You can dress them up dress them down they have the two rips and they also have pockets in the back, which is also good. And these pockets in the front are also real. So we like that. But again, these are just like basic jeans. They're wide leg. Um, and I just, I honestly like needed a new pair of like jeans like this. Cause the ones that I had were getting a little bit old, but not bad for Shein and like not bad for the price. So when I ordered stuff, like I try to like make outfits in my head. So I'm not just ordering like a bunch of random stuff. Um, so I ordered these shorts that have like a little fringe on the side here and I tried them like when I tried these on I was like a little scared because I, I was like a little scared because I was like they might be too short They're actually not they have they have a lot of stretch which I was so happy about because usually like pleather it doesn't stretch that much. Um, I ended up getting these in a large because, again, like, I do have big thighs, so that's always a concern. These don't have pockets, though, which is kind of annoying, but it's okay. I mean, the leather shorts are super cute. And what I had in mind with this, and it might be a little much. You, you guys let me know down below, but it was, like, this red top that's kind of, like... I don't even know what material this is but again another halter top because i feel like they're just in i like that you can like tie this because you can always adjust for it to fit lower or like higher um and you also have the string here in the front that you can adjust to make like tighter or looser um it doesn't have anything in the back which i feel like because like you can adjust it in the front this one again i did get in a medium because I wouldn't, I wouldn't wear a bra with this. It's not like see-through or anything, which is really good. This is how it looks on the inside. So it's, it's pretty thick. Um, so I was planning on wearing like this and this with like the shorts, but it might be a little much with like some knee-high boots, but no say, no say. You guys, you guys let me know. I'm excited to wear this out because it's still hot here in Texas. So I'll definitely make <laughs> good use of this shirt. And I feel like with red, you could just never go wrong. Like you can, red can go with black, white, like with like jeans, like it can go with so much. So again, with another halter top, this one I actually um, took to Mexico with me. This one was so comfortable. Like it looks like it's jean material, which it... <sighs> Let me say this. It's like Jean Sheehan. Oh my god. One second. It's like Sheehan Jean material, if that makes sense. This one I also got in a... I'm pretty sure I got a medium, but let me not lie to you. Yeah, I got a medium. Um, you can tie this at the top here, and there's also a zipper that goes down. And then on top of that, there's like a little like belt thing that you tie in the front. You can see it better in the picture that I'll put here in the video, but like it goes like this. Put the belt and then yeah you wear it i also like that it's like distressed i haven't never seen that like in a halter top um before so i thought that that was just like a cool like design that i just hadn't seen before there's no tie in the back or anything like that this i ended up pairing up with with these like pants that is also like jean ish material it's actually these feel thicker than the actual jeans the blue jeans that i showed you guys before um, I also took these to Mexico and they were super, super comfortable. The length I feel was like perfect. And they also have like this distressed, 
um, little detail here at the top. These I ended up getting in a large. Oh, okay. Well, it says size 30. I think that's a large. I'll confirm. Um, but all the pockets are real, which is another thing that I always like. The only thing with these is that there's no front pockets, but there is back pockets. So that's good. The only thing that I did not like about these is that, so they are high-waisted, but when I tried these on or when I wore them, Usually, like, like with jeans, like, they kind of, like, press into your stomach a little bit or, like, kind of, like, suck you in. These don't do that. And I don't know if it's because, like, they have the, like, the distress detail at the top. But I was kind of, like, mm. So you could see, like, my little, like, lonjitas, my little tires, as I call them. So that's, like, my only thing. And because they're, like, a colored um, pants, like, you can see more of that, if you know what I mean. So that was my only thing. Moving on to a dress. So I feel like you can never have too many black dresses. This one I haven't worn yet. I'm actually going to a quinceanera tonight. And I think I might wear it because I want to see if it goes up. Like if it rides up. If that makes sense like when I'm dancing. So I'll keep you guys posted on that. Um, but these, I thought this was just interesting because like you can't really see it here. But it has like a corset detail here in the front. It's like the, the material that I would imagine. And so what someone told me a long time ago is i don't even remember but like these dresses that have like the fringe on the side i've been told that they don't rise up when you're dancing or like walking so i try to like get dresses like this to like um to basically avoid that problem and then this dress also comes padded which i think is always nice because you don't have to worry about like putting anything underneath and, and whatnot and i also think the length was pretty good it's not extremely short it's not extremely long so i also try to get like they're like the ruffles because I feel like they cover up my low handles. You can like hide them easily. Um, versus a dress that has like no ruffles if that makes sense. Or like no extra fabric. And it also has this um, like little tie feature. So like it obviously goes like this, right? So you can make this like tighter or a little, a little looser. So it, that is also adjustable. The next dress that I got, I was expecting a different material. Because I feel like the picture, it looks like... The material that they were showing or how they showed it in the picture the material looks a little bit more fancier so the dress is like gorgeous again this corset like here in the front but the material is like a like a more casual material like i don't know if you can tell the difference between this one and like this other dress that i just pulled out but this is like a fan i don't even know what it's called but it's like a fancier like going out material and this one is like not <laughs> The cool thing about this one though is that it's really stretchy and again it has like this um, like halter top type of vibe here that you can put over like this um, and it also has like a like so you have like the dress underneath and then it has this to like go over it. For me a good dress is one that doesn't ride up. I'm hoping that it doesn't ride up. I feel like this one's a little bit shorter but we'll see. We'll have to put it to the test still but still like I haven't had a I haven't bought a red dress in a while. And I feel like a red dress just like always makes a statement. Another thing that I got were these pants. I thought for some reason these were going to be denim. They're not. <laughs> so they're like, they're wide, they're like boot cut. Um, or like not boot cut, but like wide leg pants. And they have like these things that go down the center here. And they go all the way down, which I thought was cool. And they actually like, you can actually adjust them to be a little bit more open or closed. The material though, it's like a stretchy, like I don't know what this material is called. It is super stretchy, but again, like if you have like a little like, as someone walks by, if you have like a little like stomach pooch, like I do, like I feel like with this material you can tell, like you can't hide it, which is annoying, but oh well, it is what it is. Like I don't know what I would put them with, or like what I would wear them with, let me know in the comments if you guys have any ideas. Maybe with the red shirt, but I feel like that'd be a little too much with like all of this going on. I feel like you'd need a more simpler top. I don't know if I like these yet. I guess it'll just depend on, on where I wear them and like with what shoes. Like with, with what am I supposed to wear this with? We'll have to we'll have to consult my mom because she'll she has better ideas than I do. These next two items are a set and they're more like I said like on the business business side. Um, and I always try to find stuff like. If I'm going to do business events, I always try to find something that's like businessy and professional, but still like 
doesn't look like I'm 50. You know what I mean? And I feel like skorts have been really in right now. So this is obviously looks like a skirt in the front and it has like these two cuts here, but these are actually shorts. When I saw this, I was like, this is gonna be a little too short. And it wasn't. And I was super glad. I actually already wore this out um, and got a lot of compliments on it. A brown is like, for me, I love brown. I feel like you can do so much with brown. Um, so I had to get it in brown. It has like these little things here on the side that are just for like, I guess a detailing, like you can't really adjust any of them. It does have a zipper in the back. Um, and this I did get in a large again for the same reason because it looks short in the picture and I was like, okay, let me not get a medium. Um, and it fit, honestly, like it fit perfectly. It fit like a freaking glove. So this is the bottom. And then the top is like this little jacket. Actually, I'm gonna leave it on the hanger so you guys can see it better. Um, and it's like this little jacket. It's like a crop jacket. I feel like a crop jacket just makes you look like like you're younger. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because I feel like I like the long business jackets, but I feel like these definitely make you look like you're on the younger side. Um, so it has like these little three buttons here on the side. Focus, please. Camera, work with me. Okay, yeah. It has these little three buttons here on the side. It does have a button in the front that you can button up. It has like a fake pocket here, which I mean, I get it's like a crop top. So I don't know if a pocket would even fit. Um, but I have nothing bad to say. Again, like, I feel like you can do so much with brown. It's really cute. It does get wrinkly really easily. So I steamed this before I wore it out. And then, like, when I got back, um, it was already, like, wrinkly again. So I was like, okay, it's just, like, that type of material. But I really, really like this. This next one, again, going to the statement pieces. <laughs> um, I really like denim. Some girls don't like denim. Talking to you, Sanchez. Um... <laughs> Again, it's hot here in Texas still, and this is such a statement piece. And this is such a statement piece that you can wear with, I don't know yet, but I'm gonna figure it out. But I knew that like when I had, like when I saw this, I was like, okay, this is definitely something I would definitely wear to like, let me just turn this off. Like a jaripeo or something like that. I don't know if I would do like a denim on denim or like, I don't know like jeans but like have them be a different color and still be denim i'm not sure yet i'll have to look at pinterest pinterest is like a really good place to go look at um for ideas but i like the like the off like one side is long and then the other is obviously like this like bra thing going off like like selena vibes type of thing um the only thing is that it only has like a button here in the front and this i got in a medium so yeah if it's if it's just right my only concern is like when i go like this i don't like it that it kind of rises a little but again that's just because of the way i'm built but yeah and this pocket here in the front <laughs> is fake shocking don't know what i'm gonna wear it with yet but um we shall see again going with um another bottom that i got with a sport um that kind of has like this thing where it goes off to the side so there's a button here that actually is a real button here i'll show you guys so it opens up like this i don't know why they actually made this a real button i don't see the the point of it but whatever so that it has a pocket here and on this side on the outside they are real pockets again not that big but a pocket is a pocket so i'll take it um this is actually really stretchy i was also concerned that this would fit pretty short it's not too bad. Um, I would have liked it a little longer because I feel like if I'm like dancing or if I bend over to pick something, I feel like it would like come up. But it's, I just won't bend over and pick something up. <laughs> but it does have pockets in the back here. Um, and I, I always like having like black shorts or like a black bottom like this where you can kind of like pretty much match with any color. Um, and you can dress this up or dress it down. So yeah, and it has like this like little detail here at the bottom with a flap. So we'll see where I wear this to. I don't know if you can make this Western. I mean, I'm sure some of y'all girls out there know more, like have more ideas when it comes to that stuff. So let me know. <laughs> and we'll see what I, what I put this with. This is our second to last item. So these are another pair of jeans that I ended up getting because... Um, they're blue, so they go with everything, but they also have a little detail here on the side where you can like, they're buttons where you can basically unbutton the whole thing. Cause I posted a video of these jeans that I was dancing in that were open on the side and they were Shein jeans that I had gotten, but 
there was like I had like rhinestones that were holding like the two sides of the jeans together I'll post a video here so you guys can see what I'm talking about but they ripped so I ended up taking all of them off and so they were just jeans that were just like open from the side and a lot of you guys were like oh my god where can I find those jeans where can I find those jeans and I was like uh these aren't the original pair like that's not what they look like when I bought them so I tried to find a pair of jeans for you guys that like you could do that with and so I found these. Um, so they do, have, like I said, they have buttons all the way down. Um, these are a size large, I believe, as well. Yeah, they're size large. But these, like, barely go over my thigh. Like, I'm able to wear them, and they fit perfect, like, here at the waist because they are high-waisted. I also like getting high-waisted stuff because I I have a long torso. So if I get, like, normal-waisted or, like, low-waisted, it just looks weird. But anyway, these are high-waisted. But like I said, they barely fit over my thigh. Like, I'm, like, jumping to put them on, which scares me because they are shoe and jeans. So I'm afraid they might rip. But they do look pretty good. Um, like I said, they don't give you, like the biggest button in the world like they don't shape you but they also don't like make it flat they also do have back pockets and front pockets which is a really good so yeah but they like scrape the floor floor a little bit for me um again as a reminder i'm like five seven five eight so long jeans are always like oh, thank you you know okay and then for my last item it's not a halter top it's not a corset either. Well, maybe it is a corset. Maybe you can call it a halter top because it does tie at the top here. And it is like a type of like corset where you can adjust the whole thing. And it is like a pleather. And again, because I do go to like Vilas and Honey Pales, I love like the Western look of like fringe. I don't know what I'm going to wear this with yet. Um, it has like no adjustments in the back, by the way. But I feel like this could go with either something like black just because it, the the other side of like the fringe here does, it is black. Um, I was thinking of wearing it with the shorts that I had gotten in this order too, but I feel like that would be too much fringe. Or I don't know, what do you guys think? This one doesn't like, it doesn't smell funny because I've gotten some Shein products that are like pleather like this and they have a really bad smell that like... I have to wear a couple times or like wash a couple times for the smell to go away. This one doesn't have a smell. Thank goodness. I don't know what gives it that smell. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to wear this out because I feel like, again, another little statement piece. And it's not like too out there because the color is still like brown. Alright guys, that was it for this week's video. I'll make sure to link all the products down below so you guys can go um, shopping as well. If you guys do post um, a picture with the product on your Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, tag me so I can see what you guys come up with. And of course, I can get some ideas as well because I'm always looking for like new outfit ideas. Um, I feel like my audience has like always the best ideas i don't know why like outfits like putting outfits together just isn't like my forte you know but anyway make sure to like the video comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one bye